Former Chief Registrar of the Judiciary Gladys Bosch-Chalet has announced her intention to seek an elective post in the coming general election. Chalet, who was suspended over alleged financial impropriety, says she's ready to report directly to the electorate in Wasangishu County. Here's Caroline B. with those details. <laughs> After what she terms as thorough consultations, former Judiciary Registrar Gladys Bos Cholet has finally made public the political seat she will be vying for come the August general elections. Your cousin Atafuta, near women representative was in Gishu County. Mina Taka Munia Nike Kazi to Fukuza Umaskini Katika was in Gishu County. Staki Kazi and Yanajiandika Mimwenyao Ama Kwena Kujita Futia, Mali Mimwenyewe. Nataka ama cheo na jitafutia. Cheo ni shapata. Cheo ni shamaliza. Kazi zingine za serikali ni memaliza zote. Ile kazi sasa nataka kufanya ni ya wasingishu county. Speaking in Plateau in Wasingishu County, Mrs. Sholei urged the residents of the area to elect her, vowing to improve the poor agricultural sector in the region besides promoting youth empowerment. She said all her country's problems result from bad laws which can only be sorted in the National Assembly. Na shida ya watu wa Singishu County ni kaanza kuelewa. Hapa kwa shamba tunakwanga na vijana wengi tu wanakuja tunafanya kazi na hawa, ni kaanza kuelewa kwamba vijana yetu wadogo hawana kazi. Watu wamesoma university na wanakuja kuomba kazi ya kulima shamba. Nikasema hiyo ni makosa kabisa. Pia mimi ni mkulima wa maziwa. Na bwana Willy Kirwa pale kutoka Kapselet ndio alinifunza kuwa mkulima wa ngombe. Na pia nikaanza kuona tuko na shida ya bei ya maji ya maziwa. Pia nikaanza kuona pia tunapanda mahindi hapa nikaanza kuona tuko na pe, eh, shida ya bei ya mahindi. Gladys Sholei, together with seven others, were charged with abuse of office and issuance of contracts contrary to the law, which saw her suspended. The case is currently in court, with a hearing set to continue on the 20th of February 2017. Caroline B., KTN News.